So what is up everybody? It's your boy Lens. Back at it again with a new One Punch Man the Strongest video. I'm gonna change my account augmentation series. I'm gonna start calling it Lens Assist everybody. Let's get her going. Lens Assist. So today we have Brother Snorlax from server 97 up in here. And we're gonna do a little bit of an account reversion here. So, this account has been slightly mismanaged and I want to help him uh, condense his Star Ascension cards into units which he'll be using for the long term. So I'll only be doing the reversal of the Star Ascension cards. I won't be actually allocating the units because I will leave that decision up to him. So let's have a look at each of his characters. So from here, immediately I can see his Amai has access uh, Star Ascension card, so I'll be beginning the doctoring everybody. We're gonna be deleting some stuff. So we're gonna delete his uh keep six stars. So we're gonna get back started seven star ascension cards. It doesn't cost any reversion cards. His golden ball can reverse his insignia as well. If you've done all your extra damage resistance, you don't really need uh, star ascension cards on your characters. Show you a nifty trick if you want. You can just skip here so you can actually reverse the units. You can reverse that. Let's see his talent slots. No, oh, there's nothing too much to worry about. Let's see his Amai uh, talent slot. So let's say you have a problem here. You can just do this. Well, for main lineup, I don't think you can. Yeah, you can't. So. For other units, you can just scroll like this. PSK mm, can remove. Let's see. Wait, let's see. Okay, we've reversed quite a bit. So let's see actually how many stars you can cut this sort of thing before we proceed. So right now we've reversed Amai BK and DSK so that's 7, 7 and 4 if I'm not mistaken so 7, 7 and 4 oops sorry so 7, 7 and 4 that's 14, 18 so okay let's say we're gonna start now from 24 let's see how high we can get but of course I'll be reinvesting into the level 1 badges again I'm just gonna just pop it all the way up to I'm just gonna stop at 93. Maybe for my OCD fans, I'll just push it to 95. There we go. And the same for Golden Ball. Uh, I'm not so sure whether he wants to still continue using Golden Ball, so I'll just leave it at that. Uh, for Beast King, you're definitely gonna need it at least until 60 ish. I don't think you need until 80, to be honest. And uh, some of you might be thinking. Might be thinking like, no, this is such a waste, why are you doing this? The reason being is that you should not be spreading your star such a cards in the first place. Personally, I would reverse this as well. Uh, but his BK doesn't seem to be having that much of luck. Let's see whether he has a better gangster set before I push through this. So, hmm, doesn't seem like he has. Uh, anything else going on? He has an intense amount of uh, blue gears, so it's going to be a pain to score off this. Actually, he might be able to just do a broken set BK to be honest. Uh, we'll think about that later. Yeah, okay, he's Amai. Probably this should be a tap attack as well, uh, in my opinion. So we just have a look at this primal set. Set it to attack attack. It only has attack HP. So I guess the damage rate over HP is still better. If it's flat. Uh let's see. Other units to reverse now. Sorry, I got sidetracked a little bit. I'm just going to clear his lineup first. Just in case. So I'm just gonna put some N units in there. The pad, funeral suspenders, and then the station man and some of this. 
Okay, so I will not reverse his CK. But let's have a look. Okay, you probably need to invest more into your CK actually, to be honest. Uh, this is fine, you might want to keep the Insignia at 2 stars actually. 3 stars is not really that worth it. But since it's your main unit, it's fine. This is, uh, this is okay. I wouldn't necessarily touch his tank top master like that. So we're just gonna move here to Buketsu. Buketsu is fine. Okay, moving on. Am I? Done. Zombie man. Okay, this needs to go. Next. Let's see. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. STK needs to go. This one needs to go. You can keep the HP on Janus if you want. So this needs to go. This is done. This is clean. 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 Okay, so that's it for the characters themselves. Now let's have a look at the gearings. So we'll go from gears and then to buff gears. So gears, this is fine, this is fine, that's good. This is good, this is not so good. So we we'll have a look at his attack speed gears. And if he has no choice, this is fine. If he does have a choice. Okay, I'm getting very annoyed with this gears. This actually going to be, let me see this, this orange one. Should be Personally, I would highly recommend you kill all your green and blue gears because you're never going to use them anyway. Uh, and uh, if you're looking for suit set, you will have no shortage of them for cut loss. So you don't need to worry too much about it. I'm just going to remove at least the defense gear out of the way. It's quite a lot to scroll through. Defense or defense bonus. Yeah, all this can be deleted. Even dismantle it. I highly recommend you just dismantle your defense just, just don't put yourself through the pain of having to look for For your gears by scrolling all the way down several pages, it's just not worth it, guys. Like, seriously, you get access gears eventually. Don't worry about that too much. So, you have attack speed, but it takes up that percentage slot, so we just leave that at that. Uh, preferably, you should be running a primal tank top master. But uh, it seems that your primal set isn't the best. HP, HP, speed, yeah. This is fine. Uh, if you can get monk, also, that's pretty good. Okay, so it's about as good as it gets. It's like being orange. So that's fine. Uh, my mask don't seem to have any mismanaged stars. Zombie man has a mismanaged star. We'll probably remove this. See. Go to dismantle, go to revert, and remove the star. Because you see all these little little stars which you invested that you think is a good idea is more likely than not going to end up being a big problem uh, when the time comes for you to reverse everything. So it's best to get it out of the way now. Uh, I will push it up to you uh, for you to at least level 80 and then after that it's on you whether you want to push through or not uh, I would say it is a smart idea to maintain it like that uh, any more than that might not be suitable so here we have a couple mismanaged stars which I'm going to remove as well because I don't bother me any stars matter 
So all this will be dismantled for extra stars. Your stars should be condensed into your two main units, preferably one tank and one main damage. So once you revert, uh, if you want to run Golden Ball, you actually have a Golden Battle Set here if you want. You can actually put that on your Garo, to be honest. Let's move this and add the Battle Set here, and now your Garo is boosted. Okay. Let's just remove that and add back the block first, and then let's have a look at the damage up. So yeah, 3 2 2 2 2 8 1. And then with the battle set, you have a slightly lower attack, 3 1 6. So let's push it up. So we're gonna go to level 90, and then we're gonna actually invest our energy cards into this unit because that's how it should be. You should have one main damager and one main. Uh, support or tank. So, but for my account, currently it's Garo and CK. For some people, they prefer Tank Top Master, <coughs> Mika. <coughs> uh, for others, they prefer other units. So, we have 49 now. So, a lot of Star Attack cards have been reduced. Just now, we were at 24, if I'm not mistaken. So, all the Star Engine cards on your minor characters can be redistributed to your major characters. And uh, if you want to put Gears and Golden Ball again, sure, by any means, but uh, it doesn't really matter too much. You can remove this from this game actually. Uh, you don't really need it that badly uh, because your Beast King should be gaining his attack quite well from other sources. I'm just gonna revert this as well because uh, these are pretty bad. Gears in general. So we're just going to go for attack, attack bonus. And if you have a shiny, that's better, but it doesn't seem like you have a shiny. So we're just going to push this up. Okay, the problem with this king, right, is a lot of people like to start as you cut his keepsake as well as throw tasks and you cut to his gear to get his attack to ridiculous uh, states. Although that is good as a PvP. P player, that is not your priority at all. So why are you investing into something that's not your priority? That's just counterproductive, in my opinion at least. So just invest into something that they will bring you returns in the section that you want. I'm not saying don't invest in the PK, I'm just saying don't over invest. So you have 200k, you still have buff gears to get. And uh, this is fine. You want you can keep it a three star, but just don't push it further than that. Uh, for your damage wise, you can push it up uh, via evolution. Yeah, limit break him. Uh, beginning should stop, and of course open his talent tree. This is a major source of damage. So that's that for your BK. Let's have a look at your DSK. So no stars here, no stars here. I pray to god there's no stars here okay there shouldn't be any more stars below this oh 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 what we have attack vaccine man wow i haven't wow okay okay so uh for those of you who don't know vaccine man is best built with hp so i'm actually just going to slot in better hp this way over here uh... Let's see, do you have HP, HP percentages? Mm -hmm. We have HP, HP percent here, and HP, HP percent here. Okay, dismantle your purple gear for the star. There we go. So that's settled. Okay, go. I pray to God there's no stars in three cards on Okay, go. I can only pray though. I've seen nightmares. Okay, so that seems to be it for the mismanaged stars. So let's see where we stopped at. We were at 24 earlier. And currently it should be under material. We have 54, so we went up by 30 star session cards. So we mismanaged 30 star session cards. So that's a lot to be honest. Now you can actually push for a very strong unit now because we have 
the CK can actually push to almost 3 million HP. You are just lacking uh, a lot of talents. The talent tree for Garo is not unlocked as well. Actually, I'm going to do that now. I'm actually going to unseal this for you. This is where you should be spending. Uh, you should also be spending on your Koketsu since you intend to main him. If I'm not mistaken, that's what you said. Uh, if you're not getting Genos, then you have no choice but to main Koketsu. I'm just going to get some sharp, sharp swords here. And you don't seem to have Vitality Sigils. You have a level 3. Or oh, you have a level 4 on Koketsu. Hmm, oh, okay, yeah, you can remove this. Uh, and put what is this here. Or you can put Rebellion for crit resistance if you're struggling with that. So level 4 sigil here. You have some sigils to synthesize. So you, you might want to take note of that sometimes because they can be very good sigils and you can actually get uh, really high level sigils from synthesizing. Especially if you do talent often. And uh, please make sure you redeem your sigils from uh, cut contacts. So, I'm just going to do some sharp sword sigils here. We have a level 2 one here. It's not the best, but it is what we have, so we make do with what we have. If you know, other characters, actually, you can put slot in a piercing there to be honest. Yeah, you seem to have quite few. Sigils, so you might want to start buying a lot more sigils. Yeah, we don't have anything important at the moment. Your Garo's attack went up by considerable amounts. So I'd say uh, once you open your country, it will probably skyrocket. So I'm actually going to just invest a little bit of uh, stars and cards here just to get your Garo back to speed. I think I just stopped two for now. And your attack is almost uh, about halfway to 400k. So, definitely massive improvements to your units. Uh, your CK wise, you can actually push this for uh, 3 stars each. And then your buffers, please get better buffers. Please farm more nightmare CCs. Uh, let me have a look. Yeah, you don't have any more spare buffers. So, yeah. Now, uh, once you get to CC 15, it should be pretty good. So other than that, I think your account has been adjusted as best as, as it can regarding the Star Searcher cards. Uh, your spread is controlled now to 4 units. And then uh, some of your PvE units still have uh, access, car, uh, access Star Searcher cards. If you feel like you need to remove it, please remove it. Uh, it's not necessary to keep it on Golden Ball to be honest. I'm just keeping it for the sake that actually please reverse this. Almost missed that. Other than that, I think that's about it. If you want to, I, I'll leave the access materials for you here uh, for your exclusive items. So you have 1100 orange books. If you want to reinvest into your previously deleted unit, I suggest uh, Zombie Man definitely. DSK just for Hero X Monster. And then, other than that, it should be fine. Regarding your purple stars, the spread is still a little bit too large but after this you'll be able to reverse purple stars uh, for diamonds in tomorrow's update so yeah, you don't need to invest your reversion cards into it anymore uh, That's it from me guys uh, I tried to keep this video as short and informative as possible but there's quite a lot of things to reverse So thank you so much for watching I hope you learned a lot about how to manage your SEC spread uh, I will be releasing my Crossover Club War video tomorrow, so do stay tuned. Peace.